New this morning, SDG&E unveiling its new energy storage facility in Kearney Mesa. Yeah, ABC 10 News reporter Marie Cornell is there live. And Marie, the construction of this facility will help with the state's goal of producing carbon-free electricity. Jim and Virginia and the state has to reach that goal by the year 2045. A big part of that will be those lithium ion batteries that you see right there. They will be key in making this happen. With the cut of a ribbon, SDG&E's new energy storage facility in Kearney Mesa is ready to go. This is the power company's first of its kind project that uses lithium ion phosphate batteries to store carbon free electricity. This is being built in a, in a location where, that used to house uh, combustion generators right? that were built in the 1950s. And this is just a, a good example of how our grid is transitioning, how our city and our communities are transitioning to more uh, cleaner sources of, of energy. SDG&E Vice President of Energy and Innovation Miguel Romero breaks down how this works. It allows us to provide energy uh, when supply is short in those hot summer days. And we saw that a, a couple of years ago, how we needed more resources across the Western United States. And on the other hand, it also provides other benefits, such as providing key uh, resiliency needs uh, when there's emergencies uh, or we need to uh, create that type of backup power. Miguel says this facility can help power 13,000 homes for up to four hours. And he says there are more facilities like this in the works across the state and in our region. All part of the plan to reach the state's goal of producing 100% carbon-free electricity by 2045. As far as the additional facilities Miguel was talking about, there are some in the development phase while others are in the construction phase. Live from Kearney Mesa, Marie Cornell, ABC 10 News.